Hey everybody. So I got my heater on, so that's the noise you hear because I get cold like very easily. Um, I wanted to do this is an update on the Emperor. My that video that I did, it has went viral. It is going crazy. Like it's being shared and shared and shared and, and everybody has their opinions and some people are happy and 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 can relate and there's others that are really upset and in their feelings about it and everything but we I welcome all comments and I have been responding. Like I'm literally that person, that content creator that will actually respond good or bad, I have been responding. Now, if you got blocked, you got blocked because you was being disrespectful. Because you don't have to call me out, call, uh, disrespect me, curse me out to tell me that you don't like what I said or you don't like how I said. There's been a lot of people that have not agreed with me and they have respectfully came into my inbox and let me know how they feel and when I told them listen pay attention go go back and rewatch the video look at some of my other videos and we've had even a conversation they're like man you pretty cool I didn't I didn't even know that like you really Nigerian there's so many Nigerians now that says oh no you you you're definitely one of us you're definitely one of us so I get, I understand, I get that people get in their feelings and they get heated. And I get that some people, the communication is not so good. So a lot of you have misunderstood what I'm saying and you think I'm coming against you and I'm not, you know, and I'm not. But this is an update for the emperor. The emperor was one of those people. He was one of those that came at me. <laughs> that was mad that was in his feelings but you know what he did right after that video he went into my inbox and I didn't block him I talked to him and we talked for at least probably about a good hour or so we had a good conversation and he says now I get it now I understand and after we had that conversation he went and watched a lot of my other videos and he said damn you cool Damn, I, 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 I get it now. I get it. So a lot of you don't get it. A lot of you came in on the tail end. Go back and watch from part one all the way up to part 18. And then come back and let me know if you have the same feeling. Because I guarantee you, you want. Me and the emperor, that is my guy. When I tell you, we went from being enemies to best friends like I can sit, literally say that's my Nigerian brother that's my Nigerian brother the emperor it please don't disrespect them and everything he is somebody that just felt you know he needed to 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 protect you know where he came from and he felt in his heart of heart like a lot of you feel that your country and everybody is being disrespected and you're sorry you I mean you're you're fed up because every time somebody talks about Nigeria it's always negative and it's something you're right you're right it's it's negative every place it is a heated subject it is a heated topic but guess what if we don't talk about it if we don't communicate, if we don't explain to America and to these other places that there is so many good people in Nigeria, that there is so many great, awesome men. If you don't, if you don't explain to the women that have been scammed, that have been, have had their hearts broken. If you don't let them know that there are good, genuine men. Let me tell you something. I can't tell you how many guys that have been in my inbox, not to, not to try to talk to me, but wanted me to be matchmaker. That's been asking me over and over again. Oh, if I could just find a good American woman, if I just like, I genuinely, I, I've even had those say, I don't want nothing from her. I don't that, that she don't have to give me any money or anything. I just want someone to be real and genuine for a change. That is those men that are out there that just look that is looking for love that do want a good one the emperor was one of them he told me him and his wife butted heads he said we fight and argue just like you over some online social media stuff and guess what and they fell in love 
and they fell in love and she's a beautiful woman and he spoke highly of his wife he was like she's my world she's my rock I like I haven't he heard a man talk that good about an American woman since my, but my husband but my husband and guess what he's Nigerian too okay so so there are good men that genuinely just genuinely want good Nigerian men because we talking about the Nigerian men I ain't talking about the American men that genuinely genuinely just want a good woman that want a good woman and I realized I found out that by talking to the emperor he educated me even on some like he was telling me you know what you should you follow you should do this you should do that you know it 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 was not like how you said it but it was what you said that triggered a lot of people like he was educating me let me tell you some one thing i'm not afraid of is education <laughs> and i know nigerian people are are highly educated are highly educated so you guys should understand more than anything than anyone that this is a subject that needs to be discussed you can't sweep it under the rug if you want if you want America, South Africa, other countries to cut out the bullshit, to stop blaming you, to stop stereotyping and looking at Nigeria as 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 like a disease, as being toxic, then you motherfuckers got to discuss the problem and fix it. Because if you don't fix it and you're just getting mad about it and you're just getting angry about it because we're discussing it, it's going gonna, it's just, it's gonna to just spread. It's going to just keep happening. You guys are so busy asking me, what am I doing? Well, what are you doing? What do you got? What the fuck have you doing, done? What have you done? Y'all keep coming at me like I'm Nigerian. I'm not Nigerian. What I do is what I do. And I do it for the love of the people that I have. I do it because I'm married to one and I love him. I do it because I love his children. And I have children of my own that I birthed and I don't want to see suffer. But you can't expect me to be Captain Save a Ho for a country that's fucked up by your people. By your leaders, you like y'all act like y'all just want me to solve everything because I'm speaking on it. No, I'm speaking on it to make awareness to my people that the bullshit that they fed you guys, y'all think it's like that. It's not really fucking like that because I've been to Nigeria not once, not twice, but several fucking times. And it has not been like that. And I wasn't treated like that. And everybody out there ain't ain't trying to scam you. Ain't trying to rip you off. Ain't trying to deplete your bank account just because you think they're in there. The, the poorest of the poor of the poor that are still giving, that are still loving, that are very much caring. It is the consistent negativity of those greedy ass Nigerians. And another thing, you got the other ones that's rich. You know why they don't give shit and why they don't help their people? Because they're scared of being poor. They're scared of them. If I give too much, if I do too much, I'm going to be where they are. Because nobody has, they haven't taught them that if you help, if you create something, if you bring in other people, Man, we can all solve this problem. But the politicians is corrupt. The rich people is corrupt. Every motherfucking, but the soldiers, the police is corrupt. And they don't want to suffer. So that's why they do what they do. And the emperor helped me realize that. He's like, it's not us. It's our leaders. And he's right. And this is the reason why this happens. But the emperor and I, we ironed it out. That's my ace coon boom. Guys, and guess what? We're going to have more and more and more of these conversations. And I'm not just having them by Ni about Nigeria. Please believe me. I didn't had some about uh, uh, America too. Chicago in particular. So y'all better check it out. But pay attention. Go back and watch the video a second and third times. And I guarantee you those Nigerians that are misunderstanding what I'm saying. I guarantee you, you'll say, ah, damn, that's what she meant. Because the emperor did just that. 
I love you, the emperor. Until my next video, you guys. Ta-ta for now.